Hi, welcome in. 60. Running out of fuel. Come to me, all of you who are weary and carry heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Matthew 11, verse 28. If you look up at the night sky, you might notice a reddish-looking light and think it's Mars, the red planet. It might be, or it just might be a star called Antares. Antares is a red supergiant that's about 700 times bigger than the sun. It's also more than 10,000 times brighter. Antares is surrounded by a huge cloud of reddish metallic dust, which is why it sometimes gets mistaken for Mars. The other interesting thing about Antares is that scientists think it will one day explode in a supernova, which is what the explosion of a star is called. It will explode because it's running out of the fuel or the gases it burns. Remember, stars are basically great big balls of burning gases. Do you ever feel like that? That you'll explode because you're running out of fuel? Maybe you've run out of patience and your anger is about to explode. Maybe you've had one problem after another and you just can't take it anymore. Or maybe you've just been so busy keeping up with school, family, friends, chores, and practices that you're ready to drop. When you feel like you're running out of fuel, don't explode. Run to God and let him give you rest. Not just sleep, though that's important too. God will give you rest from worrying and trying to figure out everything out on your own. He'll give you the fuel you need to keep going, to keep doing what's right, and to keep following him. Lord, when I get too busy, remind me to stop and spend time with you. How great! How can you be refueled by God? Slip away for some quiet time alone to read his word, say a prayer, or sing a song of praise, or simply curl up and fall asleep. And let the Lord who loves you keep watch over you.